Washing the bottles, use the sty, and his eye. I'm about to change these batteries because they're dead. You want to say hi to Cooper? <laughs> okay, we got it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a little while since I vlogged and I have no excuse for it. Just life has been happening um, and I keep forgetting to pick up the camera. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I just got out the shower. I am getting ready really quick. I'm gonna go meet with my mom friends. We're gonna hang out. We usually do like a hot mom walk or we go to the pool, but it's just so hot right now that we None of us want to be outside. I'm watching her on the monitor, playing while I get ready. I'm not doing anything crazy. I'm just putting on a tinted moisturizer and that's it. Right now I'm just putting on some clear brow gel. This is by NYX, the brow glue. This is my favorite. I love this stuff. I've been using it for years. I need to do my eyebrows so bad i just have not had the time i don't like plucking them i'd like to go get them waxed i actually want to get them laminated i've done it before and i like it and it lasts like six weeks um but i just don't have the time to do that and i have two pimples under my eyebrows like what are the chances that i literally get two pimples so annoying I feel like my skin has got has gotten different. Like my skin is a little bit different from before, like after giving birth. I don't know if my hormones are still like different or if this is just the new normal for me, but I'm a little bit more dry now. I'm using the say, I think that's how you say it, slip tint. I love this stuff. I gotta hurry up because she's getting antsy. And then I just use a brush to blend it out. This is the e.l.f. Ultimate Blending Brush. But yeah, I don't have anything planned really today. Besides that, Juan is a double at work today. So he's going to be gone all day. I miss vlogging. It's hard whenever, whenever I don't vlog for a while. It's like hard to pick up the camera again because it's like seems so daunting, but once I actually start filming again, it's like, oh, okay, I missed this. And that's pretty much it. I'm not even gonna wear mascara. I'm just gonna put a little bit of Aquaphor on my lashes. So I literally just have a spoolie and then I have tube of Aquaphor and I just squeeze a little bit, not too much. To where it's like, anyways. And I'm gonna put a lip oil. And that's it. All right, I'm feeding her. And then we're gonna go. All right, she finished her bottle. I gotta get ready to leave. Hopefully she poops right now, but we'll see. This vlog is all over the place, but it's content, right? 
I'm putting on lotion. I'm using the EOS, EOS, however you say it, and this from Target. It's the new Rouge. This smells so good, and so does this. I'm all over the place, but it's just a realistic look into getting ready by yourself with a baby. Love this, it smells so good. You hear that thunder? I hate it. I hate thunderstorms. I'm like terrified of not thunder, but lightning. So anytime it's like storming outside, I get scared. Are you done? <laughs> I think she might've pooped cause I just fed her. So we're gonna go change her and then we're gonna get her bag ready or actually I'm gonna get her bag ready first. She has diapers, lip gloss, the amount of lip glosses and balms I have in here is so funny. Cause even when I don't wear makeup, I will like bring a lip oil or something. I have this, a lip liner, a lipstick, elf, 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 I love elf, road, and summer Fridays, the best. These all live in here since I don't have a purse. I need to mention this cup because she learned how to drink out of a straw. Okay, so I have this cup, this munchkin cup that I got for her to learn how to drink out of a straw, but I felt like it's a little bit hard. You kind of have to like bite it and then suck, and that's, she's done it a couple times, but it's harder for her. So I got a new one on Amazon. This one is called Ola. Ola Baby is the brand. Um, it had good reviews on it, and the straw is just like, this is just silicone material. It has a lid that comes on it. It has the measurements on the side so you know exactly how much they're drinking. And it has a stopper, the straw, so they don't put the whole straw in their mouth. <gasps> that was lightning. Um, but I've been giving her that when we're, whenever we give her food and lunch and stuff. And she knows how to drink out of a straw now, like regularly. And it's so cool to watch your baby. But I feel like this cup was a better option for her because it was a little bit easier. I normally, like, I'll give her the cup, but I'll hold it like this so that she doesn't throw it because she's in her throwing things everywhere era. Um, but I saw on TikTok that if your baby's having trouble drinking from a straw, to put a little bit of puree on the tip of the straw and then that gets them to suck and then maybe do it a couple times and they'll learn hopefully to drink out of a straw. I'm not gonna film while I'm there just out of respect for their kids and I'm not about to film other people's kids so and I just want to like be hanging out without filming. And then you are good to go, mama. Look how cute. Look how cute you look. All right, I'm going to get ready to leave and I will see you guys in the car. I almost forgot to vlog, but I didn't. We got back at five and then I fed her. Here's Layla playing in her little thing. She's a little fussy net right now because she missed her nap she took a nap on the way there and on the way back but it wasn't like a full nap so she's a little bit fussy i'm gonna play with her in our playpen for a little bit and then hopefully we'll go on an evening walk around 6 45 but it's too freaking hot here which is why we have to wait until so late to go on a walk um but <sighs> I love going on walks and she loves going on walks. She loves to look at the trees and look at all the things outside. And I try to go on a walk every day um, since I'm home with her. I like to go out and get fresh air. But today the weather was kind of crappy. It was like raining. It's sunny out right now, but I hope it doesn't like rain again later, but it's just humid. Okay, now I'm in the playpen with her. It's as big like I think it's like 12 by 12, I don't know. It's big enough for me to sit in with her. And she just has all her toys. So she can roam around in here. She likes when I sit in here because then she like climbs all over me like she's about to do right now. So this is what we do like in the evening times because around this time, like five, six is when witching hour starts, which means now that she's down to two naps a day, instead of three 
it's like a long gap usually she takes her afternoon nap maybe like around two or three so from that time until 8 30 is her bedtime <clears throat> say hi mama <laughs> she loves this this is from her play mat that the fisher price play mat that we got her when she was a newborn she was obsessed with that thing and i like that it grows with them um so she was first laying down on it and then she was able to sit up and play with the piano and now she just plays with the piano and she loves it still. This is usually what I do. Um, sometimes I'll try to clean up or do some laundry or shower and get ready, but it's like no two days are the same in that aspect. Like I do the same things with her as far as like feeding her, playing with her, whatever, but Sometimes she's more fussy than others, or sometimes she's a lot easier than others, and I'm able to get more done, but it just depends on the day. It's the life of a stay-at-home mom. I can't believe she's already eight months. It's very crazy, but my first vlog with her was when she was five weeks old. It's so sad. I feel like when you have kids, time goes by, so, like, time already goes by fast, I feel like, but I feel I think when you have kids, it just feels so much faster for some reason. I don't know. She's on the move. I know she wants to crawl. She does like a little backwards crawl where she'll be like on all fours and then she like scoots back with her hands and then she'll like sit up again. So we're getting there. Every baby is at their own pace, so. But okay, I feel like this part is boring for people so I'm just going to come back whenever I do something different and we're going on a hot mom walk you excited to go on a walk mama are you excited and then I got this this is an essential this summer or just in general because it's hot everywhere I feel like this fan those little stroller fans don't cut it I live in Florida so you need this bad boy and I love that Eclipse because I can put it on her crib. I can put it anywhere. I use it for myself sometimes. I love it. Yeah, let's go. We are back from our walk. And now it's about 7.30. Going to give Layla a bath. Obviously not gonna record that, but getting her bath ready. And then I'll be back later. Just finished with her bath. Did you have a good bath? <laughs> She's fussy. She's tired. You're tired, girl. You're a tired girly. I know, we're gonna brush her hair, because it's crazy. Her hair's so long. So before she goes to bed, I like to give her these little soothing tablets for teething. This is from Dr. Talbot's. They have chamomile in them. Um, they're like natural soothing tablets, and they make her a little bit sleepy, um, so I give her some at night. They're tablets, they dissolve in your mouth. But what I like to do is I put them on here on a spoon and then I put like a drop, I put like a drop or two of water. And then I um, put a little bit to dissolve it. And then it looks like that, kind of like a paste before I give it to her. I mean, you could give them just the tablets, I'm sure, but I just do this to be safe. And she gets excited. You like this stuff, right? Okay, 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 okay. Here. Mmm, good job, baby. Good job. There's a little bit left, okay. So I don't do that every single night. I do it if I feel like she's teething a lot, and she definitely is. There's a lot more teeth that are coming in. She has her bottom too right now. I'm gonna make her bottle.
I think I'm gonna try to edit this video tonight. Um, so I'm gonna end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry it's been a while that I have vlogged. I'm gonna try to do this consistently. Um, also, I hit a thousand subscribers, so thank you so much to everybody who has subscribed. I am so grateful for you. Sorry, I'm looking at the monitor. And I will see you in my next video.